Alright, this is a quick demonstration of the Arson Keyword Scraper. Um, it's similar to the Keyword Scraper that's found in Scrapebox. Um, basically, you can load some keywords into here. Um, for this example, we're just going to use How To, because there's tons of stuff that'll come up for that. Um, you can pick your sources that you want to scrape. Um, Google Suggestions, uh, Google Image su Suggestions, Google News Suggestions, Shopping Suggestions. YouTube and recipes. Uh, for this example, I'm just going to do the uh, the web, and um, you have a couple options here. Uh, default here is to append A to Z, so basically it would go to how to A, how to B. And that's going to give you way more results than just typing in how to by itself. Um, so uh, you can also pick your language. Um, default is set to English, and you can select the number of threads you want to do this at. For this example, I'm just going to do 10. And we're just going to try this without proxies real quick. And I'll, I'll explain, explain proxies in a second here. Um, so we're going to do how to. And as you can see, right off the bat, you're going to get a whole bunch of uh, new keywords that you can work with. Um, 350 from just one thing. And that's because it appended uh, A through Z at the end there. Uh, you can remove the duplicates, in this case there aren't any. Um, you could uh, transfer what you have just scraped back over here and then re-scrape, which will give you even, well, it'll give you a crap ton of uh, keywords to work with. Um, let's talk about proxies real quick, because uh, if, you, if, you, uh, if you're if you constantly scraping um, Google for the keywords without proxies, eventually you're going to get temp banned by them, so that's not a, you know, that's not a very good thing. So you can uh, go ahead and you can import your own private proxies or public proxies that you scraped, or you can quick load from some URLs. I only, I've included one. I found that uh, you know the uh, the proxies that are on the website are decent speed without testing them or anything. So um, I'll just show you an example of that. You can quick load a bunch of proxies in. Um, and you can turn it on and try scraping again. Um, I think that's about it. Yeah. Uh, if this program helps you out, you know, uh, become a fan on Facebook of uh, of Arson, or um, maybe leave us a donation. We'd really appreciate it. Thanks a lot.